Dudley and Commander of the American Judge Forum Omaha Chapter. And uh, really appreciate everybody gathering here this Memorial Day. This has been quite a, a good honoring and gathering Memorial Day year after year. We have the Omaha Chapter Honor Guard uh, here to do the ceremonies, conduct the ceremonies. Well, just a brief word. I uh, just want to thank everyone for coming. And uh, we have to keep in our mind and our hearts. Uh, the people that have served the previous wars, the people that are serving in the current wars, many of uh, the veterans that are in attendance here today, many of the uh, family members that, uh, that you had to be here and present, uh, the family members uh, that have gone through a lot of the worry, a lot of the pain, a lot of the grief. We really acknowledge uh, you. Uh, so, and after this ceremony and, and good chow that we'll have today, uh, I encourage everyone to visit uh, the great sites of your loved ones and, and go there and, and uh, look for the veterans, honor the veterans. That's what Memorial Day is all about. Uh, without, uh, I do want to, without further ado though, I do want to uh, call up a, a distinguished guest uh, in attendance, and that would be uh, City Councilman Gary Durnan. Uh, Marine Corps veteran, if you would want to come up and say a few words, uh, Gary. Well, good morning, everyone. Could anyone tell me, since we have been involved in World Wars for a good number of years, and we're currently involved in several events around the globe, can anyone here, family members, friends, or relatives, tell me what the five dreaded words are? We regret to inform you. Nobody likes to hear that. This morning, uh, I stopped by to visit with my buddies, Steve Ballers. Uh, I did most of the talking, imagine that. We, we served in the Marine Corps. Uh, we did tours overseas together. He's a really good listener. Matter of fact, he's an excellent listener. Why do I say that? Because in May of 1967, I heard those words from his family. We regret to inform you Steve Balders was killed in action in Vietnam. I must tell you the next nine words I will remember till the day I leave this earth. We would be honored for you to escort Steve home. I will never forget that event. I'm asking you today to remember that one phrase I say every year. Sacrifice becomes meaningless without remembrance. So thank you all for coming here today. Thank you all for remembering. And I would echo what the commander has said. You have friends, relatives, family members that have served and have fallen. Do your best to remember them either at gravesite in your thoughts, your prayers, and your hearts. Not just today, but every day. Because we say that to ourselves, every day should be Veterans Day. Yeah. Thank you, Commander. Yeah. All right, folks. Uh, with that, I call Captain of the Honor Guard uh, issue the orders for his Honor Guard to carry out their duty. But first, we have to lay the wreath. <laughs>